Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up Twilio in Orbis X, uh, the CRM, so that you can send and receive text messages. Twilio is very inexpensive, and uh, you can get a professional number from them, and then also uh, they will be the uh, gateway, basically, for transactional messaging back and forth, um, so that it's reliable and your messages actually get delivered. Uh, Twilio, uh, they give you a trial balance as well. Uh, for around $20 and that's good for approximately 2,000 messages or something crazy. It's a lot of messages you get for free. Um, now an important thing though is once you sign up for Twilio, so I'll click over here, this is my Twilio dashboard I've logged in, but essentially you'll sign up for Twilio and then an important thing to realize is that to be able to send messages out to numbers other than your Twilio numbers, so basically to send to customers, you have to add a card on file. So even if you have a trial balance that you can still use to send messages, they want to have a card on file in case you use more than the 2,000 messages or whatever is included for free um, so that they have a number, a card number they can charge to. Uh, so you would do that under your, your billing side and you'll see a little upgrade. Uh, this account's upgraded so the buttons don't show, but it'll say, you know, upgrade project or something like that where you can add a card on file. So one of the most important things to know is that They've redone their dashboard, so it looks a little different. And right now, I actually have some things on the left-hand side here, the left menu. But yours will just say Explore Products when you first sign up. And what you're going to want to do is click Explore Products. And then it's going to show you all these different things, because Twilio has many different products available. And what you're going to want to do is look for Messaging right here under Programmable Communications. And you're going to want to pin that to the sidebar. That way it shows up here. And then you're going to scroll down and you're going to find phone numbers and you're going to want to pin that one as well. Now you'll have those both in the side menu here. So to get set up, there's a few pieces of information that you'll need. First and foremost, you're going to need a phone number. So you're going to want to click phone numbers. And then once you do this the first time, by the way, it's going to pop up tons of places telling you like, get a phone number, get a phone number. So that's the first thing you're going to want to do. In this case, I have an active phone number. Uh, but you're going to want to go to phone numbers, manage, active numbers, and then this here, buy a number. That's what you're going to want to do. So you'll buy a number. This is the number we have for our shop. And then it's going to show the services enabled, voice, SMS, MMS, fax, all that stuff. So what we're going to want to do is buy the number. Then you're going to copy that number and you're going to go into Orbis X. And we're going to go to admin and then settings and options. And then if you click the little jump to box here and click integrations, or you can simply search Twilio and it will pull up all my Twilio settings. So here I have phone number. That's where you're going to want to paste your phone number in. So you're going to want to copy this and you're going to want to paste it into your Orbis X account under phone number. Now the other way to do this is I'll go integrations and then under integrations, we have Twilio. There's their logo there. Then you have your phone number here, so you're going to want to paste that phone number there. So this I have a different one because this is our demo account. This is the actual one for our shop. So first step is sign up for Twilio. Second step is add a card on file. Third step is buy a phone number. Okay. Once you have your phone number, now is where you're going to want to set up your uh, credentials in Orbis X and set up what's called a webhook. This here. So your webhook allows you to receive messages as well. If you only care about sending messages, you can ignore this part, but I recommend you set it up. Um, so what we're going to do, we're going to go back to our dashboard. So I'll click here. This is going to take me to my dashboard. And then account info. This is where you're going to need these three pieces of ID uh, or three pieces of information rather. And that's going to go into your Orbis X account. So you have account SID, your auth token and your Twilio phone number. And you can use these little buttons here. You click copy and then you go over into Orbis X and you paste it here. Then you're going to go back, copy this one, and then you're going to go paste it here. And then the last one is going to be the phone number, which you would copy here. And then you're going to paste it there. Once that's done, you're now set up to send messages. Now, if you want to receive messages, you need this here, incoming SMS webhook link. So you're going to want to copy that link and then go back into your Twilio account. And now is where you're going to click on phone numbers, manage, active numbers, and that new number that you just purchased, you're going to click on that. Once you're now managing that number, we're going to scroll down 
to the section that says messaging and in messaging here's where you want to configure your web hook so you're gonna say a message comes in we're gonna choose web hook primary handler fails web hook and this is where you're gonna paste that value here this one here your incoming web hook I'll go back to Twilio you're gonna paste that in both of these boxes you can leave this set to get or you can set it to post either one will work fine and then the next important part is making sure that this here configure with other handlers make sure that is set to webhook a lot of this should be set by default but just in case it's not make sure your screen looks like this except replace these two values with this here I click back over to Orbis X with uh, this link right here and you can do that just by clicking copy link and then you're gonna paste that in these boxes here and then click save once you're done once you finish that part you are now fully set up with Twilio to both send and receive messages